to the boy I did not love. You have gone by many names. I will not list them. Some of them still sit too much like toffee on my tongue. They roll off a little too sweetly. I fear that if I speak them, someone may misinterpret me. I often think of you. Think of your hands or the set of your shoulders or the way your smile was always a little distant as if you were laughing at something a little different from everyone else as if the world was a joke that had been written just for you. The first time I saw you, you wore a black bathing suit. Back then, it was your feet kicking in front of me. Lap after lap in the neighborhood pool, we swam, listening to the click of the filters, the pull of the water and the chemicals surrounding our small bodies like a pulse. And I wondered what kind of books you stayed up late reading, or if you read at all. Later, I will know all your favorite books. We'll have read most of them. This is what will convince me we have a connection. I will talk about dragons a little too loudly in your presence, and even though I don't play video games, I will tell you I appreciate the art. I will come to appreciate the art. I will appreciate your art, show you my own. Try not to show how much your praise means to me. I will laugh too often, make self-deprecating faces. I will not lie to you. I will never be anything but myself, perhaps a little too much so. Hanging my quirks like dorm room posters in my conversations, you can get the 10 second version of me, the kind you find in personal ads and novels for lonely women, enjoys dramatic television, sewing and poetry, wants to learn to weld, talks to herself, knows how to tap a maple tree. Perhaps I tried a little too hard around you. You should know I never thought you loved me, but I always wondered if you could. So if we cannot be friends, at least know this, you taught me so many things. How to listen, even if it was because I was afraid to speak. How to cry when I needed to and not fear looking weak. How to laugh when I wanted to. How to write. How to drink. How to run, how to fall, how to come back up swinging. Sometimes I wonder if you ever think of me. If you respected the person I tried to be, or if I was only a peripheral figure, a five-foot shadow, occasionally amusing, forever adorable, never beautiful. Did you ever think I was beautiful? Don't answer that. You should know I never thought I loved you. But I always thought I could. But I knew our lives would never come to those crossroads. We would have to be content to be contemporaries, two paths on either side of the same stream. And I am an island girl, and you were a sailor, but somehow you are always a river away. And I haven't been a swimmer for years.